This is Wyoming's Alcoholic again. Uh, today I'm putting in speakers. Um, one of the boss speakers I put in was already blown, so I gotta go try to get that replaced. But one problem I did notice on my 99 Chevy Suburban <laughs> is that the door speakers on the, the rear doors, so there's six speakers in this uh, vehicle. There's two in the front door, two in the front doors, so uh, one passenger side, one driver side, and then on the passenger doors, or on the rear doors, right behind that, there is a speaker in each door. And then you have your rear 4x10s in the very back, which by the way I bought those little handy clips for. Um, they don't work. The rear, the rear harnesses are different than the harnesses for the six and a half speakers in each four of the doors. So what happened here? I hooked all the speakers up, put some new speakers in, and guess what? The rear doors were not working. So what happens is, is there's a there's an amplifier inside of this unit here, and it runs the rear speakers. And unless you have the amplifier powered, guess what? The rear speakers will not work. So what did I find out? Well, here's what you have to do. You have to take your blue antenna wire right here. And this is coming out of your, see I bought one of the splicing harnesses for, um, for this truck when I installed the stereo. So you can see there's the harness that comes from the vehicle and then I just, you know, connected and crimped them all to the deck. But you have to take your blue power, antenna power wire right here, and then you have to connect it to this blue and white wire here, which was actually called the power continuous or antenna connect. So once you hook those two together, your rear door speakers will work. Until then, um, you know, you're going to wonder what the heck's going on, and I check fuses and stuff, and Finally, uh, I realized this happened after I put in my new deck. So I got to looking up as to what, what caused this, and there was a lot of people. This happens to a lot of people. Everybody that puts in uh, a uh, aftermarket stereo in these 99, 98 uh, Suburbans, Tahoes, etc., they all have this problem. So this is what you got to do. Again, um, your antenna connect wire from stereo, your power antenna wire from the from the uh, harness that that you buy now if uh you're just doing it the old-fashioned way and cutting the harness out i don't know what wire that is so sorry i can't help you on that i'm sure it's not too hard to figure out but um anyways uh something i found out today while i was doing this and just thought i'd tell you guys make a quick video so as always uh, like and subscribe if you guys can um and uh i guess with that stay classy wyoming and have a good day